All right, this run is has been a bit of a head scratcher, but we're gonna try the pain candle and we're going for the no common items. So our goal here is to get something transformative out of our first blue chest. And we like picking up an initial defense because it enables us to kill rats. So it's not, it's not glamorous by any stretch of the imagination, but it enables us to do a little work. And because we got the big health potion here, we can afford we can afford to do one more but literally for two souls i don't think it's worth it we have the ultimate advantage right we have we have 100% stealth so we can really take our time but we need to figure out where we can acquire souls it's like in this case i think what i want to do is i want to do that i want to skip over you and skip over you. So, we it does that doesn't give us an answer to that guy who is still a problem. But but we we did some good chip damage to him. And we're at least occasionally parrying. Yes, this is a great example of I don't think we can kill him even despite the the hard work that we have done. We don't have a good way to kill you. A reprieve is I mean a reprieve is still a freebie. So let's let's do that. But Okay, with a big potion there, we can at least roll the dice on that. The dice have been rolled and we know what happened now. Okay, and we need to we need to survey as much as possible. I'm gonna take that. I might not have wanted to, but I wanted I really wanted to get that between the two of them. Okay, you don't get to leave yet, even though I don't want to punch you in the face quite yet. I suspect that this guy kills me if I yeah, we're not getting very lucky on anything there. I'll do that, and then we'll risk this potion. All right, and then we'll see what this is. This is an ambush. That would absolutely, without a doubt, kill us. We couldn't kill him, and then we'll need to have a patience that is very kind. We get the stat if we go left, so. Well, that was not an ideal patience. False confidence would not have been in our budget regardless. And then I want it to do damage to this guy. Game really knows how to get you good at the moment. Let's see. All right, we we had to we had to hit one eventually, and then of these, I think we grab health, and then I just see twenty five percent chance of. No, we're not gonna get him dead. Yeah, that is mutually assured destruction. I don't think there's any way, barring a series of very unlikely positive rolls for us, we're not we're not getting any good out anything good out of that. Burial ground can always have a random nice piece of loot in it, like this. Cover of Darkness and Fire Frenzy don't war don't quite do it. After spell use gain one health, three cooldown, no. Onion suit? No. I think we keep rolling. Insatiable. Ooh. 
High risk, high reward. The stats on these are bad. Uh, I think... I think I grab that. And we just... We just accept that we're going to be trading health into... How often does it happen? Each kill. Great. Well... We're dead. <laughs> oh, man. All right, so clearly... I might be wrong, but I think Pain Candle is the key to the no commons item run. Uh, since so few of the candles have, don't give you a common item, I think it might be the go-to. The 100% stealth means that we have some options, and I think all things being equal, we prefer defense there. If we're only going to get one thing, we prefer defense. But then I think, given that we have the big health potion... We can we can clear this place out a bit. I don't actually think it's worth taking the three here, though. Is it? Nah. I think we're better off keeping our, our head high. Getting a little bit of money for, for rerolls or a little bit of souls for rerolls is, is good, but... It's amazing how painful it is not having uh, not having items. Okay, so here I'm gonna hit that once and then move. So my my goal is to my goal is hopefully to get some work in on this guy, but it doesn't look like it's gonna happen. Yeah, no, I, I don't think we could have done what I what I dreamed of anyways there. So we're a toss up for who goes first on these right now. So this is likely three damage. I think we just need to we need to go to burial ground and hope for a free item. Sometimes you get one here. common item unfortunately that means it's of it's lacking value to us and that's gonna be that is likely the death of the run all right I don't know that we can convert that to actual value. I'm going to continue risking it all, I guess. We still don't have the kill on this guy. We can't do an ambush. We will die. Yeah, I think... I think we shouldn't, we shouldn't have invested in trying it all. Like... Tainted belt probably wouldn't have been it anyways. Our stat line isn't terrible. Let them work let them work their stuff out. What's your speed? 14. What is this guy's speed? Eight, and we're at seven. Chugging mask would help. Well, we're taking six either way if we do this, and I think I'm gonna do this. We we needed to we need to get a few souls here. If we don't start killing stuff, we're gonna this is gonna be a, a nose dive for sure. That guy's not getting 
taken care of. Okay. It's not it's not great. Our health is uh, our health is not in a great place. We probably won't attack that guy. All right, if we could find just a tiny bit of souls here. Okay, that's that's actually that's big. That's big for us. So where can where can we hit something and s survive? Very few places. Uh, yeah, not not great. So if I take, hold on, if I take this potion here, then this one offs me, but it gives us the opportunity to take this. Sure. Let's let's see what let's see what this blue chest has. We need to start. We need some kindness here. Not really what I think we're looking for. Poltergeist is a lot of damage. We could also went curse damage is soul damage. But thing, things have changed here. Now, Poltergeist, you can't take with you. So... Oh, really? That's the way that's going to go? Alright. I'm not angry. I'm just disappointed. But... Well, we did the thing. I, I can't complain about the result that we got here. We can take the scroll, too. And the quick draw gloves. Without a book, we're... We're kind of endangering things a little bit. And we're... I'm going deep on the prospect of, of speed carrying us for quite a while. Let's see what this has on it. Soul gains from explode damage taken. No. Scrolls don't get destroyed is a no. After spell gain 10 defense. The stats are, are not a line that we can walk. Maybe we can make this work. I think we I think we use a scroll to take the quick draw and turn it into souls for us. This doesn't kill me and we have lots of potions. What we don't have is lots of health, but we have tons of damage, we're relatively fast. Well then. Moving this way, he does not attack us. Alright, we've learned that the the hard way. I don't know if hard way is the correct way to phrase that, but see what we get here. Plus three soul damage. This is... Oh, siphon... No, siphon gem is bad for us, but soul charger is okay. Okay, we stealth past you that way. Then we chase you around. We grab a soul feed. We risk this because we can... We can absorb the, the difference. I don't think there's any way we get this guy killed, though. How much are we hitting for? Maybe we do. 
Oh, I think we're... I think if we do Soul Feed first, then we get the kill. Okay. Probably shouldn't have played with our food there, but... It's a this is a he who dares wins type of situation and we're we're very glass cannon. But I think to that end we don't we can't afford to full heal. It's a blue item. So we can take it. That feels good. Not going to get much of a reroll here, but... Hungry Sun doesn't seem like a great idea. Do we want to tank our clarity? Sure. I think that's fine. Maybe maybe the reroll was the correct, the correct play there, but... All of our stats need some... Some attention here. All right, so we will get most of it back if this fails. I'm trying, I'm trying to keep our defense from completely disappearing inside of us. 10% chance to stealth, and you can pass blockers. Passing blockers is important. Um, Okay, that guy taking care of himself was fantastic. Not excited about this guy, though. Ah, let's see. I think we keep following him around because I don't think we have... We need the health. Uh, let's be realistic. And then we can... And I think we need the souls too. So as much as I liked having that, we're going to do this. Ah, and we caught up to him. Okay. That's good. We like that. So because we use a scroll, or if we use a scroll or a book, there is, there is hope. The loom bird feels problematic. We're faster than it though, so I think we can just ice it. Can't seem to get our defense out of uh, out of the gulag, though. We will get a purple item. We have potions for this, so every little bit helps. We can create an exit. That's good. I think if we get the companion's room that gives us the fur coat, we would absolutely take it. And given that we're thinking about that, I think I'm going to go with the power gloves here for... Because the fur coat... I don't want to lose the chance at the fur coat. Which, if we don't get the fur coat, you know, all will be for naught, but... It's still free souls. Furco would have been big because it would have been for health. Plague would have been really nice, but. Uh, I don't know how hard we're hitting right now. Crossroads. I I want this key. 
Now, they can't go past. So, they're going to have they're going to have a bad time. Now, why we have the same speed? That's not very fun. Uh, no to both of these. Come on, give me something. Give me something here. I don't think I can do this. Soul Cannon? We'll rarely be able to use it. But maybe... Maybe we can swing it? At least we can delete the phase friend. But we don't we don't have the damage to do. Because we're doing four ten and we're doing twenty-three. Which is not gonna not gonna get us there. Now, we could spend our souls to blow one of these guys up. But is there any... I don't think there's any other value we can eke out of this room except killing this thing and then going into the crossroads. Yep. Man, that's disappointing. We're really near the break point of being able to make that work. Ambush with, with stealth, I think maybe this is okay. Okay, this is, this is beautiful. We have everything we need. Bunch of free souls, free purple. That that book is is gonna haunt my dreams or or whatever. Forty percent chance of intimidate might be a difference maker. Since we're since we're going high speed, I think intimidate build is is good. Trying to get these the beads to to detonate. There we go. All right, we we did the thing. We'll come back to him. Carapace, on equip, plus one health, plus one attack for each item of your most equipped set. So what, what's going to happen here? We lose we lose a bunch of clarity. We gain everything but speed. Uh, minus two clarity for others. Yeah, let's, let's go negative on clarity. Still seems like a, Still seems like a net positive for us. Hmm. We got the curse scroll there. This is not that bad. We can we can take that hit. I don't think we risk this. I think we just go to careful maneuver. Shame we didn't get the purple, but we're at least starting to get some gear. I'm going to detonate right now. Unclear, but I think if unclear if that was a good a good play, but Wow, we got we got an absolutely staggering amount of stuff to to work with here. Negative clarity is basically decided. So kind of feeling like we get our health up a little bit and see what we can do. Crit and dodge, I mean this seems so inconsequential. I 
I do think Plague is just better than Soul Cannon. So I, I will take that, but I'm a little sad about it. Because Soul Cannon was at least interesting. I just don't think we have. On item equip, we get health. Yeah, let's do that. We're, we're early enough in the run right now that I think we can make that a thing. Transcendence, I don't think, would be great for us. I'll take Frog Ritual. It might, it might be able to gain us some space. And what is up with all these potions? And why, why is Chugging Mask a common item? That's the real question. I think play gives us a lot of flexibility. How hard are we hitting now? We're hitting for 28. Assuming he has no armor. He has a little bit of armor. I forgot that that scroll requires uh, requires you to have uh, clarity. <laughs> All right, we're still not we're still not to the point where we can kill that guy. I'd like to get there, so I'm gonna keep trying to stack up a bit of attack. How close are we? Huge. All right. Nice. Okay. That that was an amazing. That was an amazing room. Don't think either of those are are what we're looking for. Ravenous has been doing some good work, but mimic friend, eh, not not great. I'm gonna roll one more time. All right. More intimidate. I like the idea of that. Do I even take a Transcendence Scroll? I don't think we're going to be nuking our entire run. So, let's not let's not even bother. Volatile is just Explodies. At least I thought it was. I don't think we're getting that, so short of short of the game giving us a key, I think we're going to have a hard time getting into that. Yep, no, no dice. Let's see what the purple is, though. We're still happy to get a free purple. So this has already basically done its work. So we could, we could go target spell, afflict six petrify to target creature. We lose a bunch of speed off of that. No, we don't lose a bunch of speed. We lose a little bit of speed. We have a great spell to go with that. But I, I don't know that that's going to make the, make the biggest difference for us. I know I'm rolling a little deep right now, but <sighs> Mistwalkers, Mistwalkers gets Poltergeist going again. How many stalker items do we have? One, two, three. So we get like plus three out of that. Sadistic Will. We are generating some poison, so all right, let's try Sadistic Will. Potentially questionable. Now we only have one, there's only one potion here and it's only healing for three. So we would take 10 damage taking this and we would lose Intimidate. So I don't like that very much. I don't think we're gonna pop an upgrade, but we'll, we'll keep it in our hip pocket. Just shy. 
Don't think we wanted any of those, though, to be honest. The fact that he died is uh, feeling like a, a great kindness at the moment, because <laughs> I was not convinced that was going to happen. All right, uh, we'll take the reprieve, I guess. We definitely don't have what it takes to uh, to drop the Birdman yet, so we'll hold off. Oh, boy. Are we... How fast are you? 22. Why am I... Why am I taking damage, then? Actually confused. Oh my god, why did I attack it? What just happened? Why did Shomi is dying there? That was terrifying. Okay. Weird. I think we need... Let's get a little more speed. There's a key, which is huge. Let's, let's go get the key. Taking damage from you. Has 28 defense. We're doing 7 damage, though. Very confused. But. I'll trust I'll trust the pro the game in this case, because something weird is going on there, and I don't wanna I don't wanna find out the hard way. Why? Uh, freezing aura is just good. Let's just get that for a little bit more reliability and resilience. Transformer is a no. Sculptor is a no. Sight Sphere doesn't really do it. Phase Boots scare me. Passing creatures seems important. I know I'm rolling hard right now. All right, but. So now it says we were killing him. What the heck changed? All right. Well, something changed. All right, we, we rolled the dice on that one. We probably shouldn't have. Our clarity, I think, is, is extremely negative, but... not hit him. <laughs> At least not until he's had a chance to marinate a little bit. We do get one of these, but it's just a one and done. No rerolls available. So this doesn't do much. Doubles our clarity, but we lose pass blockers. Or item gains one primary stat for each empty inventory slot. So we'd be gaining six defense, we'd be losing four speed, losing four clarity and one health, and we'd be losing three attack. I don't I don't think either of these 
pass muster, unfortunately. And it's got to be positioned to strike. Trying to get... The poison, the poison is doing, it's doing stuff. Two free legendaries. Wow. That's miraculous. Don't think I've ever seen that. Uh, I, I don't think this configuration has come up in all of my time playing Ring of Pain. Well, let's, uh, let's cross our fingers. Intimidate's been working. Volter is trash. Sadistic Will seems good. I'm going to roll once more, and then we're going to have to take what we're going to take. What, what does this do for us? Nothing good. Soul Cannon does nothing good. All right. Double Soul Gain if below that. That doesn't really work. Can't do that. Create a random potion on kill but we lose Intimidate. And we lose a bunch of defense. Wow, well, as soon as I saw them, I had a feeling that we were gonna, we were gonna strike out, but. that I think this is an owl I think this is an owl run okay we we lost the break point there He is great. Uh, if we're going to take the key, though, we might as well pop that. Oh, what's going on here? Uh-oh. There we go. Uh, crushing concoction. Sure. Alright, cleared the room, which we love to see. I guess Curse Bounty is better than, than nothing else that we were gonna have. I don't know how, how tough a uh, how tough an owl this is gonna be. We'll see. We currently have Doing a lot of work with our, uh... Okay, where's the... There's the thing. Holy smokes. Okay, does that leave this? this that leaves this. Oh, okay, so I think we, what do we do here? 
I think we do this. We do that. Is this thing killing me all by itself? Okay. Uh-oh. He still moves towards you. So we have to... If we move this way, what happens? If we stealth past you... Okay, so, so we can... We can do this until maybe he runs away. Okay. Trying to decide where I need to be. 20 damage almost kills me. Um, okay, I think I stay here. Okay, so now I can do this, which puts more poison on him. I think I need to leave this potion for safety's sake. I need to let those explode. Oh, this has been a brain teaser. I guess just more damage. There we go. That better be no common items done. I think we did the thing. Certainly I was better than last time. All right, there we go. Only the best. Complete a run without equipping a common item. That was not a fun run to do, I want to say. Uh, that was that was a tough one. The, the beginning of that run has a lot of... Uh, a lot of difficulty to it. Shatter. Interesting. All right. But yeah, I mean, this run was fascinating, actually. Anyways, that's going to do it for this one. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you like what you're seeing here and you want to see more Ring of Pain, say so in the comments and uh, leave me a like.